Dude, please don't dance like that. Hey guys, this is gonna be a quick shaky update, but I wanted to tell you that if you like this little focus test, my buddy Joshua Munoz and I did a, f a lot of these tests with the A6400 and this lens, and you can check out his video. I will link it above and down in the description. Did this test with multiple other tests, and he's just a really great YouTuber that is really good at explaining things. Him and I took the time to do some other tests with the A6400 and this lens. And if you're looking for those kind of things, this is a full frame test with the A7 III, but he did one with the A6400, so don't miss that. I'll link it above and put it down in the description. Back to your regular content. This lens is so great. The, the focusing on this lens is pretty darn good. I would say it's probably a little bit slower than a regular Sony lens, but I mean, man, this thing, performance for price and sharpness and just the overall look of this lens, I would buy this lens over spending like way over double of what this lens costs for the 16 to 35 Sony. This lens is smaller, has the internal zoom so it doesn't like stick out the, you know, it doesn't, you know, man, this is a family channel. What do you think? We're like Vuna guy in here? Jeez. Oh, that was weird. It's just a really good lens. It's all internal zoom. Um, it's sharp. It's, you know, it does have a little bit of distortion, but I mean, in my personal opinion, it isn't worth more than double uh, of this lens, in my personal opinion. Now, if you guys are shooting a lot of weddings uh, or, or a ton of like, super demanding on the spot, you know, corporate work, then you probably could justify spending the extra money on the 1635. If you really want to see the 1635 versus this lens, uh, my buddy uh, Jake Sloan got a hold of the 1635 and he did a great video, so you can guys can check that out. Once again, really cool dude. Overall, I believe the focusing on this camera is great. So, kudos, kudos. Tamron, you have made another brilliant lens that is going to be sold out 
for a long time, and I am one of the lucky people who got it first. Oh man, I never thought I'd be so, I mean, I was staying up late night every single time that lens was announced, and I was just, just refresh, refresh, refresh. Yeah, stay tuned to this channel. I got a lot more content coming. Yeah, there's some more 17 to 28 goodness coming. So subscribe, subscribe if you wanna see more. And if you liked it, give me a thumbs up. If not, I guess just give me a thumbs down. But yeah, go for it. I mean, there's always at least two people out there. Do all those YouTube things, comment below, chat with me, and I will see you in the future. <laughs>